Since the start of the premium trading signals group, we have had over 11 winning trades and over a 70% win rate. So if you want to join this group and learn more about trading crypto, make sure to check out the links down in the pinned comment for both the Telegram and the Discord group where you can find more information on how to join the signals group. Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great. Hope you're having a great Monday. And um, welcome to this video on uh, on NEM or XEM, whatever you want to call it. I mean, XEM is the name of the token. NEM is the name of the project. Wanted to make a quick uh, quick update on that uh, on on this crypto for well, I think you know why. <laughs> we're we're very very bullish today. Uh, we're up forty six percent right now, but um, at the very top we had rallied by um, by almost eighty percent or a little bit more than eighty percent even. Uh, so I just wanted to cover it, kind of wanted to discuss and, and uh, give you an overview of what's going on, but also on what you can expect. Um, so let's get right into it. First of all, I mean, what you can see right now is that, uh, is that NEM, the, the market cap rocketed up, obviously. Um, actually brought it back into the, in, into the top 100, which it, it was in for the longest time, but it hasn't been in that for, for quite a long time. Volume is huge, almost at around 400 million. Um, I'm pretty certain this will still go up to like 400, 450 million. Doesn't matter that that, that much, but still. Um, the only thing though, which um, I don't like is this. As you can see uh, fr 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 from the volume over like 75% of the volume is coming from sources, which I would deem as unreliable, right? So there's, there's like 71% coming from Upbit, Korean exchange. Usually when this is the case, it's manipulated, all right? And if we take a look at, 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 like, at like this, uh, these, these price movements, you can also see that on the chart. Oh, excuse me, some alerts. You can also see that in the chart and in a matter of 15 minutes, for example, we went from 4.5 cents to 5.4. And then in a matter of 15 more minutes, we went from uh, 5.4 all the way up to uh, 6.7. So I'm fairly certain in saying that uh, XM is manipulated right now. Now, that's not necessarily the end of the world. I mean, in crypto, there's always manipulation going on, but um, with a spike like this, usually also knowing uh, XM's history with spikes, as you can see, not as big as this one, but it has had a fair, uh, it's, it, it, it's fair share of spikes. It's quite likely that will fall. Uh, see, the only reason and the only way in which we could really get higher than what we reached around 7.5 cents, which by the way, is also a strong resistance level. Let's not forget that. Uh, the only way to do that is, is if we from from like the candle close can break above 6.8 cents if we can do that then all right we, we might be able to break all the way up to 8.6 8.7 cents but i'd say the chances of that are very unlikely like five ten percent i think it's way more likely that um that we will not even break above like 6.5 6.6 which is um uh, it's kind of the main resistance level right now between 6.8 6.4 cents i think we won't even break above that um, I, I, th I think we won't even break within that. I mean, so um, that leaves us under that level, um, leaving me to believe that I think it's just a matter of time before we drop down to our next support level around 5.8, 5.6. Find some support there. We might be able to actually get back up to like 6.4, 6.5, but I don't think we'll break above that. And then from there, drop down further towards this uh, stronger support level around 5 cents. And then from there, it gets interesting. From there, we might be able to get uh, some sort of a second rally, which um, happens quite often when you have spikes and rallies like this. Um, but um, but yeah, I think we'll drop down first there, first there. There we'll find some serious support and also some sort of a rally. Uh, but afterwards and after that rally, I think we'll just drop down and then ultimately uh, drop back down to like 4.8, 4.6 um so yeah that's my take on the on xem for today if you do have any questions let me know for now take care and bye